would be wrong to chronicle every breathless inch of their descent down that rabbit hole. But we'd also be wrong to ignore Hunter Biden entirely. He added, Democratic partisans who urge that aren't being realistic and are doing as much to feed suspicions as to quell them. Towards the end of the column, Bruni claimed that the media sugarcoating Biden family behavior would put us in the business of creating outcomes, not chronicling events, which would be obvious to voters on top of being wrong. It would further erode our credibility, which has suffered plenty of erosion already. It would betray the fundamental purpose and real power of journalism. He called for journalists to put their activism aside and be fair, we do best as a profession, and all of us do best as a democracy and a society, when we hold everyone accountable, regardless of the special circumstances, and when we're honest across the board. To act otherwise is to send the message that all is gamesmanship and that integrity is for suckers. Would be wrong to chronicle every breathless inch of their descent down that rabbit hole. But we'd also be wrong to ignore Hunter Biden entirely. He added, Democratic partisans who urge that aren't being realistic and are doing as much to feed suspicions as to quell them. Towards the end of the column, Bruni claimed that the media sugarcoating Biden family behavior would put us in the business of creating outcomes not chronicling events, which would be obvious to voters on top of being wrong. It would further erode our credibility, which has suffered plenty of erosion already. It would betray the fundamental purpose and real power of journalism. He called for journalists to put their activism aside and be fair, we do best as a profession, and all of us do best as a democracy and a society, when we hold everyone accountable, regardless of the special circumstances and when we're honest across the board. To act otherwise is to send the message that all is gamesmanship and that integrity is for suckers.